Let's make a butcher block cutting board from scratch. Gotta love a DIY you know you're gonna use. Start with a couple of two by twos and measure out the length and width you want your cutting board to be. Then use a saw to cut them to length and find a space that's big enough for you to lay out all of your cuts. Do not lay this out on paper like I'm doing here. You'll see why this was a big mistake a little later. I took the time to mix up all my wood pieces so that the colors would look random. And now I'm just using wood glue so I can glue them all together. It doesn't matter if you didn't cut the lengths of your pieces perfectly because we're gonna even it out in the end. Also, don't worry if some of the glue is peeking out because we're gonna end up sanding this bad boy later on. And it'll take care of all of the glue. You wanna clamp them together as tight as you can get them and then let it dry overnight. This is me the next day taking the clamps off. And this reason right here is why I said don't do this on top of paper. It did get stuck to the board, but again, don't worry, we're gonna sand it all off. So far, so good. Sand it down until you get rid of all the glue. I'm just wiping it down and then using a heat gun to make sure the wood is completely dry. Then I'm gonna add food grade mineral oil. I added a bunch of layers and let it sit for an hour in between each layer. You're gonna do the same thing with the butcher block conditioner. Again, a bunch of layers, let it sit for an hour in between layers. And here is our finished product. I can't wait to show you guys what I'm gonna do with it.